Due to the pandemic, the suicide prevention awareness walk went from this to this. <laughs> The virus is not stopping organizers of the Out of the Darkness Toledo Walk from taking step in memory of those who lost their lives to suicide. Hopefully bring our walk to people individually in their own little community or um, their own little group so that they can basically be in our hearts and on our minds that uh, we're all doing and working for the same thing today. As organizers encouraging others to have their own walk in honor of their loved ones, many did just that and joined in across town. All the souls that have lost their lives is so many and they're on the uptick right now due to the virus. People are losing their jobs, they're losing hope, uh, so I'm walking for all of those souls. You remember Queen Cookie. She shared the story of her grandsons and his mother dying by suicide. She is honoring them and so many others by joining the walk. The virus did not stop me because of my love and compassion for my grandson and his mother. Some of those walking are wearing beads around their neck. The nine different colors represents a person they lost to suicide. The beads are very significant. Blue is support of the cause of suicide prevention. Green means that you struggle yourself with some sort of mental health issues. The orange I wear for my brother Rich who died almost 10 years ago um, by suicide. Although this walk was a little different this time around, participants and organizers say they are already looking forward to next year. Well, hopefully the COVID will be out of here next year and we'll be back downtown at Parmenade Park next year. In Toledo, Zainab Shaib for WTOL 11.